Pima County is giving $250,000 to help some of Tucson's best restaurants. Nine on your side's Greg Bradbury tells us how the money is going to play a role in bringing food tourists from all over the world here to Tucson. Tucson is no stranger to good food. Its UNESCO City of Gastronomy designation means you can find unique and tasty bites all over town. The new money awarded will help stimulate many of these businesses that struggled during the pandemic. So this money and the creation of a new event um, will help to bring back some of that food tourism. The new event is called Pueblos del Maiz Fiesta. It will bring the cities of Tucson, San Antonio, Puebla, and Merida together. We were talking about, well, what should we do? We should do an event that unites and connects us. I mean, our culture, our heritage, our gastronomy are so tied together. So we realized that the common denominator for all of Mesoamerica has been corn. Felipe Garcia is the CEO of Visit Tucson. He says they don't know how many people will come, but are planning for this to be the start of something bigger. The idea is to start this this year and then go for the next 50 years and became a staple event of our community. Tito and Pep is one of the city's certified UNESCO restaurants, but they say this festival is about more than just boosting business. To get people out here so they can experience it and, and share just in how amazing our community is, uh, it's it's just a great addition and, and welcome. John Martinez is the owner and chef of the restaurant. He says in the past, his restaurant had visitors that were snowbirds or in town for baseball spring training. But now that is changing. But now we kind of have a new type of tourist so with the boom of, uh, you know, foodieism or, you know, people that are, you know, really into like exploring the world, you know, via all of their senses. The festival will run from May 5th through the 8th. Greg Bradbury, KGUN 9 on your side. Yeah, Tito and Pep, great restaurant with a, a mid-century modern vibe. It's really cool. That whole thing makes you a little hungry This even at this hour, <laughs> Kyla.